Good morning, Mountain Christian Church. Welcome to the MCC Morning Devotion for Monday, March 30th. Thank you for joining me this morning. This morning, I'd like to spend some time in Psalm 121 with you. So if you'll flip over there in your Bibles and read along, I'd love that. I lift up my eyes to the mountains. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot slip. He who watches over you will not slumber. Indeed, he who watches over Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord watches over you. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun will not harm you by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord will keep you from all harm. He will watch over your life. The Lord will watch over your coming and your going both now and forevermore. At the beginning of this psalm, the author starts off with the question, and he's looking up to the mountains. And I think that's a, a symbol of the challenges that are facing him either that day or in his life. But compared to my little person, those mountains look insurmountable and they look huge. Where am I gonna get help with this? How am I gonna overcome this? And then he answers, my help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He who is doing this duty for us will not sleep. He will not sleep on the job. And he will watch over us that we will not be harmed by the sun or the moon. And that he will do that for now and forevermore. How encouraging is that? How encouraging is it that the Lord the maker of heaven and earth knows my comings and goings. The same Lord that created all the stars in the universe knows what you're going to be doing today and tomorrow. That same Lord knows the feet, I'm sorry, knows our paths that our feet will take and he will not rest on the job. I get incredible comfort from that. And I pray that you would get incredible comfort from that. And the question is today is what will you do to share that comfort with others? How will that comfort make itself known in your home? How will the people that are around you, either physically or the ones who are in contact with you by phone or on the internet, how will they know that the maker of heaven and earth is your comfort and more importantly how will that knowledge help you love one another better brothers and sisters i hope that you find an opportunity today to share the word of the lord with your neighbors with your friends with your relatives with those who may not know and may be scared be with them love them share your comfort Share the maker. He loves us all and he wants us all to be loved by him. Pray with me. Father God, Lord, I pray that you would be with us today as we start another week. Lord, I pray that uh, you would give patience to us who are at home with our families. I pray that you would give uh, courage to those who, who want to speak out and want to share you with their friends and neighbors. Lord, I pray that you would also give us diligence to, to make use of our time together. Lord, have the conversations that we, we may be overdue. Encourage us, Lord, to, to, to take steps to make you Lord of our lives and Lord of our homes. Lord, I pray that you would be with each one of us, that you would encourage us today to pick up our Bibles and read, to spend our time in your word, and to, Lord, to spend time worshiping you. Lord, worship for you is not just on Sundays, but, Lord, we should worship you all days. Lord, I pray that you would make your Holy Spirit apparent to each and every one of us and that we would know what our part in your, your grand scheme is for today. Lord, we love you and we praise you. It's in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a great day, Mount Christian Church. We'll see you tomorrow.